सदाशिवसंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा अस्मदाचार्यपर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा ओ सुखम नित्यम स्वप्रकाशम व्यापक नाम अधिष्ठान बुद्ध्यबोध्यम बुद्धिर्दृग्यु निर्मल अपारम सर्वेदेद्यम प्रत्यक्पर मह तदेवाह न मोन्दी मे निश्चिता मति विचार सागर फोर्थ चैप्टर पेज 129 थर्ड पैराग्राफ सेकंड लाइन चक्षुर्द्वारा निर्गता कर्ण वृत्ते धूमि न सह संबंधोस्ते अतः धूम धूम ज्ञान प्रत्यक्ष निश्चलदास आंसरिंग टू तत्वदृष्टि डाउट और क्वेश्चन एस तत्वदृष्टि सेड आत्मज्ञान इज नॉट पॉसिबल डायरेक्टली direct self knowledge is not possible that means no one can understand or know the brahman directly pratyaksha gnanam na sambhavati pratyaksha gnanam or aparoksha gnanam are interchangeable the words pratyaksham and aparoksham means direct only direct knowledge even though there is a subtle difference but uh, both are interchangeable therefore aparoksha gnanam or direct knowledge is not possible that is the conclusion of tatva drishti the first disciple in this uh, vichara sagara who is a uttama adhikari for that nischala uh, dasa who is the guru because guru is name is not given therefore for our purpose we are taking nischala dasa the author himself as a guru here so nischala dasa answering pratyaksha gnanam is of uh, different types it is possible shabda janya gnanam indriya janya gnanam that is possible sakshi pratyaksham is possible therefore pratyaksha gnanam is not only indriya janya gnanam afterwards he says this anumana pramanam also one can know that there is a fire there is a fire on the mountain without seeing the fire seeing the smoke alone person come to know there is a fire on the mountain स धूम प्रत्यक्ष धूम ज्ञान प्रत्यक्ष ज्ञान सो दिस अनुमान प्रमाण इज यूज दट अनुमान प्रमाण ईज नेक्स्ट टू लाइन ही कंक्लूड्स दट हाउ ईज दट प्रत्यक्ष वी विल रीड दट पोर्शन लिंग ज्ञान रूपाुमान प्रमाणजन्यांतकृत्ति शरीर से अंतरे वन्याकार भजते न हि वृत्ते वह्नीस संबंधोस्ती तस्माज्ञान न प्रत्यक्ष अनलैक दि फयर फयर नॉलेज इज नाट पॉसिबल बिकॉज फयर ईज ऊटसइड अनुमान ज्ञान द्वारा अग्नि प्रत्यक्ष ज्ञान न भवति 
through inference one cannot get the direct perception of uh, fire direct knowledge of fire through anumana pramanam pratyaksha pramanam is uh, possible with regard to atma because atma is not uh, an external object here he concludes that linga pramanam linga gnana rupa linga means anumanam here inferential knowledge rupa anumanam pramanam this is also a one type of pramana among six pramanams pratyaksha anumana upamana arthapatti anupalabdhi shabda all six pramanams anumana pramanam cannot give pratyaksha gnanam विकास अंतकरण वृत्ति ही शरीर से अंतरेव वन्याकारम भजते वंस ही सीज द स्मोक ऑन द माउंटेन बट फायर नॉलेज इज इनसाइड फायर नॉलेज फायर नॉलेज वृत्ति द थॉट अराइज इन द माइंड अंतकरण वृत्ति ही वेर इज दट अंतकरणम शरीर से अंतरेव which antakkaranam is in the gross body so subtle body is antakkaranam that subtle body is in the gross body so sharirasya antareva sthula shariram inside there is sukshma shariram antakkaranam that antakkaranam in that there is a fire thought arise vanyakaram bhajate it takes the thought of fire thought fire thought means fire vritti the agni vritti takes place in the mind antakarana so there he is seeing directly smoke but fire knowledge is coming inside it is indirect fire knowledge paroksha agni gnanam it is not pratyaksham but paroksham vanyakaram bhajate that antakarana vritti takes the form of the fire inside nahi vrittehe vannina sah but the vritti is does not have the sambandha sambandha na asti vannina sah along with fire the thought doesn't have an association directly vannina sah sambandah na asti it is not there what is not there the, the thought which rise inside the mind fire thought does not have an association with the fire outside on the mountain it cannot have that association i have got association with what smoke not with fire सह संबंध न अस्ति वन्हिना सह अलोंग विथ वन्नि देर इज नो संबंध विथ थॉट थॉट एंड फायर डोंट हैव डायरेक्ट कॉन्टैक्ट तस्मा देर फोर वन्नि ज्ञान न प्रत्यक्ष फायर नॉलेज इज नॉट डायरेक्ट नॉलेज इट इज इनडक्ट नॉलेज परोक्ष ज्ञान it is not pratyaksham with this he conclude this topic and he consolidate uh, in the three other three topics what he has said until now so that if you are not understood previous portions at least three paragraphs two paragraphs if you understand the whole topic of this pratyaksha gnanam paroksha gnanam he Uh, is um, summarizing now in these two paragraphs you can uh, just to recollect what he said i will read this second paragraph itham yatra vritya sah vishayasya sambandho bhavati tatra pratyaksha gnanam bhavati yatra vritya sah vishayasya sambandha na bhavati तत्र परोक्ष विषयो देशांतरस्थो नष्टो नष्टो भावी वा तत्रानुमानेन शब्देन वा 
विषयाकारा वृत्ति शरीर से अंतरे वी तदेव तदोत्पद्यम तदा उत्पद्यम ज्ञान परोक्ष वाट इज परोक्ष ज्ञान हि समरइज नौ देन वाट इज प्रत्यक्ष ज्ञान हि समरइज वाट इज परोक्ष ज्ञान इत्थम इन दिस मैनर इन दिस मैनर मीन वाट मैनर एज सेड अबव मई डिस्क्रिपन अबउट इंडैरेक्ट नॉलेज परोक्ष ज्ञान इत्थम यत्र वेर वृत्या सह विथाट अलांग विथ थाट विषय से संबंध वेर देर ईज ए संबंध वित् विषय त्र प्रत्यक्ष ज्ञान एंड ऑब्जेक्ट एंड द थाट मस्ट हेव एन असोसिएशन और कॉन्टैक्ट विषय मीनस ऑब्जेक्ट संबंध मीनस रिलेशन विषय से संबंध मीनस रिलेशन विद द ऑब्जेक्ट यहा यत्र तत्र देर अलोन वेर इट इज हैविंग दैट असोसिएशन थॉट एंड विषय द ऑब्जेक्ट असोसिएशन देर यू विल गेट प्रत्यक्ष ज्ञान पॉट नॉलेज इफ यू सी द पॉट पॉट नॉलेज यू विल गेट इफ यू सी द क्लिप यू विल गेट द क्लिप नॉलेज वॉट एवर यू हैव असोसिएशन वृत्ति हेज टू गो थ्रू द सेंस आर्गान आउटसाइड then you will get that pratyaksha gnanam so vrutya vritti is not uh, visible thought is not visible nana chidra ghatodara sthita maha dakshina murti shloka shankaracharya says just as the uh, light goes the light beam goes from the holes of that pot nana chidra ghatodara sthita maha like that from this face pot like space face and all the five sense organs of knowledge are like uh, holes from them the beam of thought goes out and pervades the object you know all this just i am recollecting along sound uh, loudly i am recollecting the thought goes outside through the ears eyes with sense from sense organs it goes and pervades that vishaya sambandha then pratyaksha gnanam bhavati what about paroksha gnanam yatra vrutya sah vishayasya sambandha na bhavati just revising he is revising that revision wherever the vritti the thought doesn't have sambandha with what vishayasya sah विषय से सह वृत्या सह विषय से संबंध अलांग विद थॉट एंड विषय बोथ डजेंट हैव एनी रिलेशन कॉन्टैक्ट तत्र देर परोक्ष ज्ञान देर ओनली इंडैरेक्ट नॉलेज अरइज इंडैरेक्ट नॉलेज अलोन कम्स देन यत्र विषय when wherever there is a vishaya object deshantarastah elsewhere it is somewhere nashtah suppose in the past it was in the past nashtah or it has uh, gone already bhaviva or in future future means what suppose the fire is not seen by that person now later he can climb and go there to the mountain bhavi in future he can see that fire after few hours or few days he can go and see the fire forest fire so that fire bhavi va tatra anumanena so there through anumanam he can get the paroksha gnanam uh, or shabdena va vishayakara vritti through shabda also indirect knowledge is possible through shabda sharirasya antareva bhavati it is inside only that knowledge if a so and so place uh, you you hear through somebody that place is so nice beautiful 
beautiful sceneries are there you are listening through a person that is shabda gnana through shabda what you get knowledge that place about that place paroksha gnanam indirect knowledge alone you will get not direct experience of that place sharirasya antareva bhavati that knowledge is inside alone because vritti has not have contact with the object directly tadvat tada utpadyamanam gnanam when at that time the knowledge which knowledge arises that is parokshami ti uchyate that knowledge is known as indirect knowledge paroksha gnanam paraha ashnam paroksham which is not visible to your eyes not your sense organs that is called paraha ashnam paroksham next what is pratyaksha gnanam he revise now इंद्रिय जन्य ज्ञानमेव प्रत्यक्षमिति न नियमः सुख दुखादि ज्ञानम इंद्रिय जन्यमपि प्रत्यक्षमेव भवति दशम पुरुष ज्ञानम शब्द जन्यमपि प्रत्यक्षमेव भवति अनेन न्यायेन श्री सद्गुरु मुखात श्रुत महावाक्य महावाक्य उपदेश शब्द जन्य ब्रह्मज्ञानमी प्रत्यक्षमेवती महावाक्य वेदशब्दन्य ज्ञान नौ हि गिवस् द प्रत्यक्ष ज्ञान Indriya Janya Gnanam alone gives Pratyaksha Gnanam is the conclusion of Tattva Drishti, the student. But Guru says, Indriya Janya Gnanam eva Pratyaksha miti na niyamaha. There is no rule. There is no any rule that direct knowledge Pratyaksha Gnanam is only possible possible only when indriya vishaya sambandha is there indriya janya gnana that which is born out of um, sense organs and object contact indriya janya means you have to supply the vishaya also indriya and vishaya sambandha dwara janya gnana aindrika gnana indriya janya gnana bhavati iti na niyamah it is not uh, so without indriya vishaya sambandham vina api pratyaksha gnanam bhavati how he gives the example sukha dukha adi gnanam the knowledge about my happiness i am happy i know i am happy dukha i know i am sad dukha gnanam is there i know that i have sorrow i know that i am happy that sukha dukha adi gnanam indriya ajanyam api indriya ajanyam is there how to split indriya plus ajanyam it is not born out of any sense organs contact because that sukha is inside indriyam is not contacting that sukha now dukha also even past sukha past dukha you recollect that is pratyaksha gnanam only so indriya jan ajanyam api ajanya means not uh, born out of indriyam we saw that is uh, sakshi pratyaksham we saw that is sakshi pratyaksham then what is the third one dashama purusha gnanam 10th man knowledge in that example 10th man knowledge who missed in that um, crossing the river at that time the students they thought that sishyas you know one student thought that one person died one student died like that he thought then dashama purusha gnanam शब्दजन्यमी प्रत्यक्षमेव इट इज बॉन्ड नौट आफ 
shabdam what shabdam one mahatma came that side and he said you are the tenth man you are the tenth man this you are the tenth man is equal to tattvamasi you are that brahman hmm? you are that brahman people are searching for brahman atma outside no? when you are searching guru comes and tells whom you are searching outside that uh, searcher you are that tat tvam asi like that you can connect in this shabda gnanam 10th man knowledge pratyaksham eva that person knows who oh, i am the 10th man after making the students standing and asking counting 1 2 3 4 5 up to 9 then you are the 10th man why you are not counting yourself you are the 10th man so that is shabda gyan that gives the direct knowledge he comes to know that i am the 10th man so direct knowledge pratyaksham eva bhavati anena nyayena by this uh, nyaya o oh, tatva drishti you have to understand sri sadguru mukhat shruta mahavakya roopa veda shabdah see when um, a student jignasu mumukshu lesson uh, here what uh, mahavakya veda shabda which is veda shabda tat tvam asi mahavakya 10 9 times the guru said Nine times Tattvamasi, 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 sixth chapter of Chandogya Upanishad, Sat uh, Vidya. Though Uddhalaka uh, taught to Svetaketu, O oh, Svetaketu, you are, you are Brahman, you are Brahman, Veda Shabdaha, Samaveda, Sa- Chandogya Upanishad belongs to Samaveda. That is why Veda Shabda Janya Brahma Jnana. ಮಹಾವಾಕ್ಯೂಪ ವೇದ ಶಬ್ದ ಹೌ ಯು ಹಾಟ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಮಹಾವಾಕ್ಯ ಈಸ್ ತತ್ವಮಸಿ ತತ್ವಮಸಿ ಈಸ್ ದ ಮಹಾವಾಕ್ಯ ಆಫ್ ಚಾಂದೋಗ್ಯ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಚಾಂದೋಗ್ಯ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಾಮವೇದ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ವೇದ ಶಬ್ದ ಸಾಮವೇದ ಶಬ್ದ ಸಾಮವೇದ ಶಬ್ದ ಚಾಂದೋಗ್ಯ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಸತ್ವಿದ್ಯ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ತ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ತತ್ವಮಸಿ ಮಹಾವಾಕ್ಯ ಟಾಟ್ ಬೈ ಉದ್ದಾಲಕ ಶ್ರೀ ಸದ್ಗುರು ಸದ್ಗುರು ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಶ್ರೋತ್ರಿಯ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನಿಷ್ಠ ಗುರು ಸದ್ಗುರು ಮುಖಾತ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಹಾರ್ಸಸ್ ಮೌತ್ ದ ಗುರು ಶ್ರುತ ಮೀನ್ ಒನ್ಸ್ ಯು ಲಿಸನ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಗುರು ಗುರು ಸೆಡ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ದಟ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ದಟ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಜ್ಞಾನಂ ಅಪಿ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ಷಮೇವ ಎಸ್ ಐ ಆಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಶ್ವೇತಕೇತು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟುಡ್ ಐ ಆಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಅಹಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಅಸ್ಮಿ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ಷಮೇವ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ ನಾಲೆಡ್ಜ್ ಅಪರೋಕ್ಷ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ಷ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಆರ್ ಅಪರೋಕ್ಷ ಜ್ಞಾನ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಡೌಟ್ ಹೇ ತತ್ವದೃಷ್ಟಿ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಮ್ಯಾನರ್ ಯುವರ್ ಇಂದ್ರಿಯ ಜನ್ಯ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಅಲೋನ್ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಯು ಶುಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸೈ ವಿಥೌಟ್ ಇಂದ್ರಿಯ ಶಬ್ದ ಜ್ಞಾನ ದ್ವಾರಾ ಪ್ರತ್ಯಕ್ಷ ಜ್ಞಾನ ಭವತಿ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಪ್ಯಾರಗ್ರಾಫ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಸದ್ಗುರೋ ಏಂ ವಿಧಂ ಉಪದೇಶ ಶ್ರುತ್ವ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮಾನುತ್ತಮಾಧಿಕಾರಿ ತತ್ವದೃಷ್ಟಿ ಸ್ವಾತ್ಮನ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇಣ ವಿಧಿ ಭೇದ ಭ್ರಮಂ ಬಿಜಹೋ ಅಹಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಅಸ್ಮಿ ವೃತ್ತ ನಿರಾವರಣ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಭಾತಿ ತತ್ವದೃಷ್ಟಿರೇವಾಚ ಶ್ರೀ ಸದ್ಗುರೋ ದಿಸ್ ಸದ್ಗುರು who is sadguru here nischala dasa nischala dasa is the sadguru if you write in english sadguru sad guru you should not read sad guru 
गुरु इज नॉट सपोज टू बी सैड ओके सदगुरु सदगुरु मीन्स वाट द वन हु नोज अबाउट द सत इज कॉल्ड सदगुरु दैट इज द मीनिंग सदगुरु मीन्स नॉट शोइंग एनी मैजिक्स एंड ऑल लॉट ऑफ गिमिक्स नॉट सदगुरु द सदगुरु इज वन हु नोज द ट्रूथ एक्जिस्टेंस ब्रह्मन एज हिमसेल्फ अर हर सेल्फ दे आर कॉल्ड सदगुरु सदगुरो हो एवं विधम इन दिस मैनर ऑफ दैट सदगुरु हुज वर्ड्स एलोन उपदेशम श्रुवा हैविंग हर्ड श्रुवा हैविंग हर्ड वाट उपदेशम यू सी उपदेशम मीन्स नाट वन मंत्रोपदेश हाउ मेनी उपनिषत्स भगवद्गीता प्रकरण ग्रंथास लॉट ऑफ लर्निंग इज इनवाल्व पीपल मिस्टेक दिस वर्ड उपदेश मीन का इन द इयर टीचर से तत्व असी तत्व असी तत्व असी थ्री टाइम्स हो ई कैन गेट ब्रह्म ज्ञान नो वि हाव टू सिस्टमैटिकली स्टडी फॉर ए लेंथ ऑफ टाइम अंडर ए कॉम्पिटेंट अलाइव टीचर वाट यू हाव टू स्टडी स्क्रिप्चरल वेदांतिक स्क्रिप्चर यू हाव टू स्टडी then alone your knowledge is right knowledge without any doubt samshaya rahita gnanam upadesham that is called upadesham <laughs> don't take simply upadesham means hmm, mantra upadesham madri edukka kodadu mahavakya upadesham mahavakya upadesham is the most difficult hmm, sadhana to study for a length of time giving quality mind quality time with a lot of shraddha with a lot of qualifications therefore how he tatva drushti received the knowledge buddhiman uttama adhikari tatva drushti hi so nishra dasa praising that tatva drushti now buddhiman very very intelligent person uh, इंटेलिजेंट मीन्स वाट हि साधन चतुष्टय संपन्न बुद्धिमा विवेकी वैर विरागी एंड हि हेज गाट लॉट ऑफ इंट्रस्ट इन नोयिंग द ट्रूथ उत्तमाधिकारी द फुट नोट इट इज गिवेन हू इज उत्तमाधिकारी ओके वेरी इंट्रस्टिंग वाट इज उत्तमाधिकारी फुट नोट गिवेन See, there is a number on Uttama Adhikari, number one. In the footnote, la, Yasya Antakkaranam Purva Punya Paripaka Vashat uh, Atyantam Shuddha Masti <laughs> What is Uttama Adhikari in the qualification? In the, because of Purva Janma Punya, whose Antakkaranam is uh, extremely pure. Extremely pure means without any split personality manasekam vachasekam karmani ekam he is called uttama adhikari words thoughts and deeds are in alignment that is the pure mind suddham asti now i am reading the footnote yasya guru padishta mahavakya rupa shabda pramanena sudridha bodha jatah because of that pure antakaranam pure mind without any raga dvesha kama krodha very 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 pure mind guru upadishta when the guru taught to that student shabda pramanena mahavakya pramanam surdhadah form knowledge jatah form knowledge arise in the mind of tattva drishti yasya cha tadrishe sridhrada bodhaha um, anantaram bodhaya anantaram samshayadi nivruttaye shravanaadi sadhana anantaram na apekshate what is the um, uh, indication of uttama adhikari uttama adhikari is one who receive that self knowledge aham brahmasmi gnanam from the guru by 
जस्ट टीचिंग ऑफ द गुरु एंड बाई लिजनिंग ही गेट्स द नॉलेज एंड नो मोर साधना इज रिक्वायर्ड फॉर दट स्टूडेंट ओनली श्रवण मात्रेण ज्ञान भवति श्रवण मात्रेण मननम इज आलो नाट रिक्वायर्ड निधिध्यासनम इज आलो नाट एट आल रिक्वायर्ड लाइक के नोपनिषत् स्टूडेंट उत्तम अधिकारी नचिकेत स्लैक् सो दट वाट निश्चलदास सीस् श्रवणादि साधन साधना न अपेक्षत अदर दैन श्रवण वट इज देर मननम निधिध्यासन नाट रिक्वायर्ड फर् उत्तम अधिकारी मननम इज नाट रिक्वायर्ड निधिध्यासन इज नाट रिक्वायर्ड मननम निधिध्यासन आर् रिक्वायर्ड ओनली फर् मंद मध्यम अधिकारी नाट फर् उत्तम अधिकारी उत्तम अधिकारी वाख्या श्रवण मेण आचार्य सेस हियर श्रवणादि साधना आदिपदा मनन निधिध्यासन नापेक्षते सह एव उत्तम अधिकारी दट पर्सन अलोड इज कॉल उत्तम अधिकारी ऐ एम डूइंग मननम ऐ एम डूइंग निधिध्यासनम अनर्दम ऐ एम अनौंसिंग पब्लीशिंग ऐ एम नाट उत्तम अधिकारी अब कुछ कष्ट लिया कष्ट उत्तम अधिकारीत्व इज नाट सो ईजी उत्तम अधिकारी डजेंट रिक्वायर् मननम एट आल फर् हूम मननम इज रिक्वायर्ड वे देर आर् डऊट्स संशय निवृत्म मननम आवश्यक वेन् संशय ये नास्ति किम मननम करणीय दिध्यासनमें विपर्य विपरीत भावना भवति चेत निधिध्यासन आवश्यक विपरीत भावना न अस्ति चेत किम सह निधिध्यासन करणीय तस्य निधिध्यासन आवश्यक नवति ऐ एम टाकिंग इन संस्कृत ओके जस्ट इट इज कमिंग लाइक दैट ऐ वन इन वैल ऐ टाक इन सैनस्क्रिट ओके फर् दोस् स्टूडेंट्स हू आर् इंट्रेस्टेड इन लिजनिंग सैनस्क्रिट वन इन वैल तस्मा तत्वृष्टि उत्तम अधिकारी तस्मा तस्य श्रवण मनन निधिध्य श्रवणमे पर्याप्त मनन निधिध्यासन न आवश्यक निश्चय सह एव उत्तम अधिकारी दट अबौट मंद अधिकारी मंद अधिकारी आर् मध्यम अधिकारी कनिष्ठ अधिकारी गिवेन निश्चलदास नाट टाकिंग अबउट मंद अधिकारी कनिष्ठ अधिकारी मीन आपोजिट टू दिस उत्तम अधिकारी मध्यम अधिकारी आर् कनिष्ठाधिकारी आर गिवेन इन दुट नोट ऐम नाट रीडिंग बट ऐ विल टेल यू द वन हू नीड्स आफ्टर श्रवण द वन हू नीड्स मननम एंड निधिध्यासन लेटर साधना दट स्टूडेंट ईज का मध्यम अधिकारी आर् कनिष्ठ अधिकारी सो आपोजिट टू उत्तम अधिकारी दट ईज द मीनिंग नौ फुट नोट ओवर नौ लेट एस कम टू द पैराग्राफ बुद्धिमा उत्तम अधिकारी तत्वृष्टि तत्वृष्टि वाट हेपेंड स्वात्मा ब्रह्मेण विदि हाविंग अंडर्स्टुड विदि मीन हाविंग अंडर्स्टुड वाट स्वात्मा हिज ओन सेलफ द इंडिविजुअल ऐ एम ब्रह्मेण ऐ द इंडिविजुअल ऐ एम नदर दैन ब्रह्म अलोन ब्रह्मेण विदि अहम ब्रह्म अस्मी भेद भेद भ्रमं विजह हि हेज ड्रॉपड विजह मीन हि हेज ड्रॉपड हा धा लिट विजह प्रथम पुष एक पदे हा धा त्यक्तवाथ हि हेज गिवेन अप विजह वाट हि हेज गिवेन अप भेद भ्रम भ्रम डेल्यूशन हि हेज गिवेन अप वाट टाइप ऑफ डेल्यूशन भेद भेद मीन हियर ब्रह्म इज डिफरेंट ऐ एम डिफरेंट दट भेद भाव दट डेल्यूशन हि हेज गिवेन अप हाउ हि हेज गिवेन अप बिकाज ब्रह्मेण स्वात्मा विदि हाविंग अंडर्स्टुड दट 
he himself his real nature is brahman alone then what happened he has given up that uh, delusion bheda brahman dvaita bhavana he has given up aham brahma asmi iti vruttau i am brahman alone aham brahma asmi this is mahavakya from brahadaranya kopanishad which belongs to the shukla yajurveda in yajurveda there are two branches um, shukla yajurveda and krishna yajurveda shukla yajurveda upanishad brahadaranya kopanishad there this mahavakya comes aham brahmasmi mahavakya so that aham brahmasmi iti what he has understood viditva means he has understood what he has understood i am aham i am brahma brahman asmi i am brahman that is in within inverted commas mahavakya iti thus how it happened vruttau niravaranam brahma bhati vruttau brahma gnanam is also a vritti gnanam aham brahmasmi gnanam is also a vritti gnanam that is why in vedanta we never accept stopping the mind eliminating all thoughts and sitting in the subcon going to that supra conscious turiya tita avastha we never accept in vedanta we very much uh, encourage to entertain the thought you have to understand this in waking state not in meditation not in samadhi you have to recognize this fact you have to discover this fact in waking state when the thoughts are rising eliminating all the anatma thoughts replacing those anatma thoughts by the atma aham brahma asmi iti vrittau in that thought vrittau that vritti is what type of vritti niravaranam brahma bhati niravaranam unconcealed brahman unconcealed brahman is revealed bhati means shining revealed brahman <coughs> un unconce- unconcealed brahman is revealed <laughs> brahma bhati <coughs> bhati means shining vritti vyapya avaranam nivritti hi vritti vyapya avarana nivritti hi phala vyapti is not required because that atma brahman happens to be myself there is no necessity of phala vyapti going outside that object and are not required so i am brahman that vritti is sufficient that is why vritti vyapya asam avaranam nivritti hi that vritti pervades the entire antakaranam aham brahmasmi vritti pervades so that antakaranam is mithya antakaranam is mithya vritti gilso mithya vritti gnanam also mithya but vritti gnanam what is that is revealed the revelation is satyam vritti gnanam is also mithya because vritti is mithya it is a born knowledge but about what that vritti gnanam vritti gnanam here in this context aham brahmasmi iti vritti gnan therefore aham brahmasmi i am brahman is satyam and vritti gnanam reveals the truth and vritti gnanam goes away that is what we have to understand aham brahmasmi iti vruttau niravaranam brahma bhati niravaranam brahma means that brahman without any without any delusion confusion brahman is free from delusion only but the mind is having a lot of confusions because of rajoguna tamoguna 
Now this knowledge is possible because of predominant sattva guna. Predominantly sattva guna and quality mind he has given for Shastra and Uttamadhikari and therefore he is able to um, understand that truth I am Brahman, Brahman shines. Bhati means shines means what? As oneself. As oneself, don't uh, take it Bhati means shining, shining and uh, thousand watt bulb like that Atma shines. Na. These are all uh, not correct. That type of thinking you have to drop. Just awareness. I remain as awareness. I am conscious principle. I am existence consciousness principle, eternal principle. I am formless through this thought mind like a mirror. Like a mirror it is. And Takkaranam is like a mirror. In that mirror, that Chidabhasa, in that Vritti takes place to show my real nature, having received that, understood that I am Brahman, then say goodbye to medium. What is the medium? Sushma Shariram, Chidabhasa, Antakkaranam, medium, which is in the Stula Shariram medium, RM1, RM2. RM means reflecting medium number one. Stula Shariram, RM2 reflecting medium number 2 Sukshma Shariram. In that Sukshma Shariram individual, the Jeevatma, that is Chidabhasa Sahit Antahkaranam. There in that mind the thought rises, I am making use of this Sukshma Shariram. Listen carefully. I am making use of this Upadhi. It is like a mirror, it serves like a mirror and it shows my real nature through Vritti Jnanam. What type of Vritti Jnanam? Aham Brahmasmi Vritti Jnanam is possible only when the mind is there, Vritti can rise. Mind can be there only when there is Chidabhasa. Mind can function. That Chidabhasa is taking place in the Sukshma Shariram, Sukshma Shariram in the Sthula Shariram. Therefore, Chidabhasa like Kannadi. <laughs> in that I recognize I am Chit. I am Chit. Prithibimba Mukham appears in the mirror. Recognizing that I am Bimba Mukham. Prati I remove and I replace it by Bimba Mukham. Through Pratibimba Mukham, through reflected face, if you understand example clearly, Atma Jnanam is also simple. Through Pratibimba Mukham, reflected face, which reflected face is, has taken place in that mirror medium, through Pratibimba Mukham, I recognize the Bimba Mukham original face. Correct? Similarly. Through the Antakaranam mirror, in that mirror, through the Vritti Jnanam, Vritti Jnanam, Pratibimba Mukham like Chidabhasa, I recognize Chit, Bimba Mukham like Chit, I recognize. Therefore, therefore what? Mirror is important or Pradibhimha Mukham is important or Bhimha Mukham is important. Mirror is used for the sake of Pradibhimha Mukham to form. Pradibhimha Mukham, I looked upon, looked into Pradibhimha Mukham, not that I love Pradibhimha Mukham. <laughs> okay? Not that I love Pradibhimha Mukham. I love Pratibhimba Mukham to see my original face. I love my Pratibhimba Mukham not for Pratibhimba Mukham sake. I love my reflected face in the mirror for not reflected face sake. I love the reflected face for the sake of original face. Similarly, 
ಐ ಮೇಕ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಚಿದಾಭಾಸ ಅಹಂಕಾರ ನಾಟ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ಲವ್ ಚಿದಾಭಾಸ ಐ ಲವ್ ಅಹಂಕಾರ ಚಿದಾಭಾಸ ಅಹಂಕಾರ ನಾಟ್ ಐ ಲವ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ಲವ್ ದಟ್ ಚಿತ್ ಚಿದಾಭಾಸ ಐ ಮೇಕ್ ಯೂಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಟು ರಿಕಗ್ನೈಸ್ ಚಿತ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಐ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟಾಪಿಕ್ ವೆರಿ ಮಚ್ ಐ ಹೋಪ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಲೈಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಐ ಲವ್ ಚಿದಾಭಾಸ ನಾಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಚಿದಾಭಾಸ ಸಿಕ್ ಐ ಲವ್ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಕಾನ್ಷಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ಆರ್ ಸಿ ನಾಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಆರ್ ಸಿ ಸಿಕ್ ಬಟ್ ಐ ಲವ್ ಚಿದಾಭಾಸ ಫಾರ್ ಚಿತ್ ಸಿಕ್ to recognize chit i am to discover that i am chit really speaking because of me the chit alone chida bhasa is there without me the chit chida bhasa cannot be formed without me the original face there is no pratibimba mukham reflected face what a simple vedantam you see therefore i am chida bhasa ar chit i am chit chit means chaitanyam chaitanyam means brahma therefore i am the chit consciousness i am conscious of i am conscious of therefore i am a conscious being consciousness is gnanam gnanam is brahman satyam gnanam anantam brahma therefore gnanam is equal to brahman brahman is equal to gnanam gnanam is equal to chit chit is equal to i am brahman how beautiful knowledge aham brahma asmi iti vrittau niravaranam brahma bhati niravaranam now there is no any concealment any veiling no viparita viparita bhavana no samshaya anything i am pure brahman i cannot be anything else other than brahman now why whatever anything else is mithya chidabhasa is mithya antakaranam is mithya sushma shariram is mithya and um, stula shariram mithya mithya means lower order of reality i the chit am higher order of reality that is the meaning so tattva drishti hi evam ubacha tattva drishti says oh, oh guru i got ham brahmasmi gnanam like this he express see how he is going to express niravaranam nirbhasam aham brahmeti buddhyava buddhavan sri sadguru prasadena yakandakara vrittitah like that every student one day or other they have to share with their guru yes guru what is your teaching is wonderful excellent i have understood it is very difficult to not to understand when you teach oh guru like that shishya has to say and how long go on and on and on hearing but not telling any outcome is not there suppose hmm? how guru gets disappointment no at least some Uh, one day or other i have to come and tell yes guru i have understood i am very very happy your teaching has given me this knowledge like that tatva drishti sharing you see that niravaranam nirm say niravaranam aham brahma iti i am brahman i have understood i am brahman what type of brahman i am niravaranam that which is not concealed that which is not concealed um, then nira nirbhasam self evident niravaranam uh, niravarana nirbhasam aham nirbhasam in self evident brahma iti i am brahman buddhavan i have recognized i have understood buddhavan means i have understood aham buddhavan you can supply what i have understood aham buddhavan i have understood that i am brahman aham brahma iti 
अहम बुद्धवान ई एम ब्रह्मन दट ई हव अंडरस्टूड ई हव अंडरस्टूड दट ई एम ब्रह्मन दट ईज द मीनिंग श्री सद्गुरो प्रसाद ई हव अंडरस्टूड वै नाट बै मेडिटेशन नाट बै डूइंग एनी भजन नाट बै एनी अदर प्राक्टीस बट श्री सद्गुरो प्रसाद बै द ब्लेसिंग ऑफ मै गुरु हु ईज श्रोत्रिय ब्रह्मनिष्ठ गुरु प्रसाद मीन हियर नाट एनी सुंडल एनी प्रसाद पोंगल आर एनी थिंग हियर प्रसाद मीन टीचिंग प्रसाद मीन टीचिंग वाट ईज दट ई हव अंडरस्टूड अखंडाकार वृत्ति हि हि मीन इंडीड ई हव अंडरस्टूड इन मै मैंड यु सी दट तत्वृष्टि इज क्लारीटी यु अंडरस्टैंड हियर वृत्ति फ्रम द थाट वृत्ति पंचम्यर्थे तसी फ्रम द थाट हि डेंट स्टाप हिज मैंड ओके डोंट सिट इन द मेडिटेशन एंड स्टॉपिंग द मैंड टू नो अहम वाट इज ऐम आत्मा ऐ एम आत्मा नो दट इज वै हि वॉन्ट टू ब्रेक दट टाइप ऑफ थिंकिंग ऑफ द पीपल वृत्ति अखंडाकार वृत्ति दट इंडिविजिबल थाट इंडिविजिबल अखंडाकार मीन इंडिविजिबल थाट दर्ज नो द्वैत दर् इज नो द्वैत अनात्मा इज नाट देर there is no second thing there is no second to think uh, thing to think there is no second thing really then what is there only brahman that i am that is why vidya gnanam is very important mithyatva nischayam is very important unless you don't see every object as mithya how to see swamini mithya na everything is a product made out of five elements five elements are jadam or not jadam jadam is inert mithya or not mithya therefore every object is mithya what about body body is sentient because of me the chaitanyam consciousness body mind they are not sentient by themselves therefore i the atma i am blessing the body mind to be sentient because of my blessing they are sentient therefore akhandakara vrittitah therefore mind is useful body is useful stula shariram is useful sukshma shariram is useful antakaranam vritti चिदाभा आल आर् इंपारटेंट उपाधि इज इंपारटेंट टू उपहित चैतन्यम एन क्लोजर ईज नाट फॉर् एन क्लोजर सेख कंटेनर ईज नाट फॉर् कंटेनर सेख कंटेट सेख पायसम इन द कंटेनर आर् यू इंट्रस्टेड इन पायसम आर् कंटेनर ऐम इंट्रस्टेड इन पायसम ओनली स्वामी नाट कंटेनर सें वे upadhi is the container body mind complex is the container dabba it is like a enclosure <laughs> dabba like container like tumbler like uh, make use of this upadhi it's wonderful it has umpteen doshas in spite of that doshas are there but it is wonderful glorious body mind complex if you know mana is mind is wonderful beautiful if you do not know same mind is bharam mano bharam if you understand this oh what a wonderful mind what a wonderful body what a wonderful medium see the glory of the mind body it is helpful for the rise of akhandakara vritti aham brahmasmi vritti tah अहम बुद्धवान दट ईज द ग्रेटने आफ नॉलेज तत्वृष्टि उत्तमाधिकारी रिकग्नज नौ ऐ कंक्लूड दिशीवासुदेव ब्रह्मेन्द्र सरस्वती विरचिते 
ವಿಚಾರಸಾಗರೆ ಉತ್ತಮಾಧಿಕಾರಿಣ ಉಪದೇಶ ನಿರೂಪಣ ನಾಮ ಚತುರ್ಥತ್ತರಂಗ ವಿತ್ ದಿಸ್ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಇಸ್ ಕನ್ಕ್ಲೂಡೆಡ್ ಇತಿ ದಸ್ ಶ್ರೀ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇಂದ್ರ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಯೂಸಿಂಗ್ ನಿಶ್ಚಲದಾಸ 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 who is this vasudevendra saraswati <laughs> we have forgotten because regularly we don't use vasudevendra saraswati name original author of vichara sagara in hindi is nischala dasa that hindi version of vichara sagara is translated into sanskrit ವೈ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇಂದ್ರ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವಿರಚಿತೆ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ವಿಚಾರ ಸಾಗರೆ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ವಿಚಾರ ಸಾಗರ ಬುಕ್ ಹುಚ್ ಈಸ್ ರಿಟನ್ ಬೈ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೇಂದ್ರ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಉತ್ತಮಾಧಿಕಾರಿಣ ಫಾರ್ ಎ ಉತ್ತಮಾಧಿಕಾರಿ ದ ಬೆಸ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಜಿಜ್ಞಾಸೂಸ್ ಮುಮುಕ್ಷೂಸ್ ಉಪದೇಶ ನಿರೂಪಣ it is established nirupanam established what teaching upadesha nirupanam in this uh, teaching is given for tattva drishti uttama adhikari upadesha nirupanam nama chaturtha taranga fourth chapter taranga see the whole book name is sagaram ocean vichara sagaram the ocean of enquiry the ocean of analysis enquiry therefore chapter name he has given as taranga taranga means wave so book is called ocean like in that chapters are called taranga and the topics are called avartaha na small small ripples like big wave and small ripples taranga taranga topic uh, big wave is like taranga small small topics are called ripples like so that is uh, chaturtha taranga over with this uh, uh, fourth chapter is over uh, we are going to enter fifth chapter in the next class uh, i will give you the summary of this chapter because the main teaching is given here in this chapter because first three chapters there is no main teaching only a general anubandha chatushtayam first chapter and special anubandha chatushtayam in uh, second chapter then uh, who is um, what are the qualifications uh, the third chapter is uh, only introducing the shishya and the guru that is given and that uh, real guru right guru who is and who is the real shishya all given in third chapter now fourth chapter only main teaching has come so i have not given summary of first chapter second chapter third chapter because there is no much teaching um, in involved but in fourth chapter very very important teaching that to uttama adhikari is he has given therefore it is better to see the summary in the next class ಓಂ ಪೂರ್ಣಮದ ಪೂರ್ಣಮಿದ ಪೂರ್ಣಾತ್ ಪೂರ್ಣಮುದಚ್ಯತೆ ಪೂರ್ಣಸ್ಯ ಪೂರ್ಣಮಾದಾಯ ಪೂರ್ಣಮೇವಾವಶಿಷ್ಯತೆ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಹರಿ ಓಂ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಹರಿ ಓಂ